Hey diecast fans and collectors, um, today I wanted to show you the uh, cars I got uh, at Goodwill and I'm going to have to take a break for a little while because I spent too much on uh, aftermarket cars, uh, but let me show you two of them I picked up uh, yesterday at Walmart um, that are brand new first. Uh, I got these two BMWs. Um, I'm only going to start buying the ones that are uh, only ones you can get, like, if you buy those. Like, it's a casting you can only get in a premium line. Like, I looked this up, and you could only get this as a premium. So, I got two of them. And if they get more, I'm probably going to get, like, three more of these. And then I'm not going to buy any more of these for a while. Um, but, yeah, yesterday I went in, and they had the whole set. They had, uh, they had that one, that one. And those ones, I can make that easily. I pretty much have that. That I already have the blue variant, so I don't really need the orange one. So, yeah. Um. Anyways, uh, let's get into the cars I got in my old town. I told you guys I was going there. I already uploaded the ones I got loot uh, that were in the package. So uh, I got the Goodwill in my old town just legit had dollar store cars that's all they had and they were a quarter a piece so not bad i wish they were that at mine because they literally have the same thing but they were a quarter no hot wheels not surprising because they were a quarter this little wine back race car i think it works does it oh yeah it does here it goes it's got the little things on the front of it busted off that looks like we might have a camaro Fire Chief? Is that a Camaro? Or is that a Porsche? Or is that a Supra? I don't know. It's going in with the fire truck, so I really don't have to figure out what it is. Um, this right here. I gotta get used to this, guys, because I uh, moved the camera a different way uh, to see if the sound would be better. So I don't have to keep editing the videos just to get it louder. Seems like a waste of time. Um, oh boy, I can't fix this one right now, but yeah, I got this Ferrari. Seems like it's kind of busted. I think I have this, but I just got all the cars they had there because they were only a quarter, so I was like, I'll get them all. This thing's interesting looking. Porsche. Look at that. Cheap looking little thing, but I like it. This... This I thought was cool. I think it's custom. I don't know, but it's it's cool. I like this thing. I think I got the whole set of these where they originally came from. I'll just leave him over there for a second. I'll show you guys the whole set at once. So there's a imitation square body. A race car. Get him out of here. That one works really well. Another Fire Chief, I think, Jaguar? So I might have got, like, Fire versions and Police Car. I didn't really pay attention to them, but I think I got Fire and Police versions. This busted bulldozer, I want it for the wheels. I pretty much have the bulldozer, so I can use those wheels. I got this because I have cars like this, but they don't have wheels like that, so I thought that was interesting. So I got that. Uh, this Digger Charo Q knockoff. I have a feeling a lot of these are from like an Easter basket or some weird store or something. Mercedes, I have a lot of those. That's going to go off to the side because that's getting customized. That's also going to get customized. I have quite a bit of these too. This is pretty cool. A little pride from like Chuck E. Cheese or something. Fast little thing. couch and I got one that was broken but I was able to repair it uh, they probably charged me for both parts which sucks but yeah they probably charged me for both parts because I didn't put it back together yet but that, that one's quick it's like a little what is this a Pontiac Aztec what is this thing no I think it's some kind of Honda or Nissan I don't know it's cool though I think it goes with that little blue one uh, here's another one of the police vehicles. I believe goes with him. They're, yeah, they have to. They're the same truck. One's a tow truck and one's a, a covered bed. 
Then we got this uh, police convertible. What is this, a Mitsubishi, a Lamborghini? I don't know. This was the only Hot Wheel I found there. Pretty cool one for a custom. I think I already have that car, so. Little Volkswagen thing. Cool little color there. Probably a Halloween one, I would say. Yep, it, it is. I see a jack-o'-lantern on it. This, I have a red one of these in my collection. And now I have a silver one, so that's pretty cool. I got this rock for photo purposes. I'm taking pictures of cars. I don't know. You're like, why can't you just use real rocks? I don't know. I just, I just, I just got it. I don't know. Uh, this right here, this is what all oh, probably these other race cars are supposed to look like. I believe these probably came together. But yeah, that, that one's a little broken. This one is pretty good. Let's see if it rolls. No, not that well. And there's the other police vehicle. I think that's the whole set right there. Metro Police. That's, uh, I don't know what that is. If you guys know what that is, you can tell me. I don't know what this car is. Is this based off of a real car or is this a fantasy car? I have a feeling it's based off of a real car, but I don't know what it is. I have quite a bit of those in my collection, too. Um, there's more to that. Right there. A little Charo Q knockoff. Got to put it together. Volkswagen. Now, I remember getting a little toy set like this at a store called BG Discount. I used to have a yellow one of these. Man, I miss those little plastic cars I used to have. They're gone forever, though, most likely. Here's another one of those Porsches that goes with that... Uh, that blue one, most likely. I think I have these already, but they're very broken. Or no, I have a silver one. Yeah, I think I got that from that set I'm talking about. So, yeah, someone must have got that same set and just didn't want the cars. Um, nope, that's not a fire one. Ferrari. Another car I have that I'll be customizing. I have this, so I'll be customizing that. Oh, that drifted. I wish that got on camera. That was pretty cool. Uh, I got to make sure. I might have this. I might not. I got to check. I'm not sure. It's a black variant. I know I have the one with the colored wheels. All right, and those are all the cars I got from that store. Oh, yeah, and this, I got this shovel. I didn't find the bulldozer. I just wanted this because I could add this onto, like, a truck or something. I don't know. Snow plow. Um, now I'll show you the ones I got at Goodwill yesterday, and then I got some at my local game store, and they actually had a lot of good ones yesterday. Uh, this bone shaker. Pretty sure I already have this, so custom. Those DD8s will look nice on another car. This Porsche, don't have that. That's pretty cool. I don't even know what brand this is. It doesn't say either. It's cool. This, I didn't realize this was a police car until after I bought it. Pretty cool looking little thing. This, I got a plan for that. I already have this. I have a lot of these, and I've been trying to collect them for these. For a very good reason, and you'll see why that is. Maybe. Um, I got this because now I know how to saw cars and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, this um, I got this because I'm going to saw the roof off and probably put a roll cage in it or something. I don't know. Um, a Morgan. I only have one other one of these in my collection, and it's this exact one, so I guess I'm going to make a custom one of that one. A BMW. Very cool looking. Don't have that one. I'm not sure if I have this one. I have to look. Sorry, there's a stupid train. There was just one before I started this video, and now there's another one. Stupid things. 
Um, right here, we got this Oldsmobile 442. I don't find these very often to customize. I do have this, so this is getting customized. I don't know if this one is or the other one I have is. I think this one is because I think the one I have is in better shape. But I'll put that over there for now. This race car was pretty cool. I think that's really cool. I like that race car. I thought that was a McDonald's one for a second, but it's not. This is pretty cool. I believe I got a blue one like this a while ago from Goodwill, so it's funny. I got the red one from there now, too. I like this red one. It's very cool looking. And then I got this. I didn't mean to get this. I grabbed it. I was like, oh, wow, that's a newer Hot Wheel. And I was going to put it back, and I accidentally ended up buying it. So I guess it's going to get turned into a pickup truck or something. I don't know. You'll figure out why I said that here in a minute. I'm going to show you guys something. Um, now let me get the ones I got from the game store. There's a lot more. Would you shut up, train? Jeez. All right. Right here, this F-150. This was banged up. I fixed it up today. The wheels was like all bent, and this was popped out. and It rolls really good now. I fixed it. I don't have this guy, so I wanted to fix it without taking it apart. And I did. It's not in perfect shape, but it's good. So it's going in the collection. Um, This, I believe I have this. I hope I do because I would really like to customize this. I've been buying these lately to customize them and make civilian versions of these because they haven't really made a civilian version of this guy, and I'd like to have one or two or three or four or five. Um, I got this um, armored van. There was like a British sticker up here. Like, about the size of a Band-Aid. It's not a Band-Aid, but I kept it and put it in my box to put on another car when I customize it. So, it was still sticky. So, I'm going to put it on something else. I'll probably put more glue on it and keep it. I don't know if I have that. I believe I have the other variant of it, but I don't know if I have that one. This Jeep. Every time I find this Jeep, it's got to have something on it. Every time. That one I found in the, a vid in the video a while ago. That was like a rally one. That is like the normalest one I have found. I don't know why they always mess with that Jeep. I know they're for kids. That I'm not complaining about that. I'm just saying that I want like a normal version of that Jeep. This was cool. I thought this was very cool. And the lady at the store did too. I don't know if I have this. I want to say I do, but I don't think I do. But yeah, it's pretty cool. I like that one. I don't know if I have this... If I do, oh, wait, I, oh, this is broken. Can't turn it into a convertible, then. It's missing the, well, I guess you could if you use the glass only. Yeah, if you use the glass only, you could turn it into a convertible. I might make that into a convertible if I have it. Uh, this truck right here, I don't find these very often, but lately I've been finding them quite a bit, so... Pretty cool. I don't know. This might be in better shape than mine, but I don't think so because I think mine came from a five pack. I wish I could find the rest of the cars from that five pack. I got this dragon for my wife. She likes these cars, so I got her that one. She don't have that one. This agent car. The older ones of these actually used to shoot the things out of them. I'm kind of glad they stopped doing that though because every single one I have is pretty much missing. Fast 111. I was surprised they had some of these. And there's another one of these. So let me just leave this here a second. Let's get those police cars out of the way. Leave him back there a second. Oh, and I grabbed the other one right away. They're different. See? They're the same car, but they're different. I think that's both color variations of that guy. So that's cool. Um, This race car. Pretty cool looking little thing. Only other color I have this is like a lime green. So I have another one now. I bought this because now I know how to cut stuff out. I'm going to cut this motor out of this and do something with it. I don't know. Oh, whoops. That goes over here. Now we're there. The boom box is what I like to call this. I think it's called the, what is this thing called? Baseline. That's what it is. Sorry, I know this is an accelerator's car. Surprise, some people weren't happy that I didn't know the name of that. But I don't know the names of all the fancy cars, just the ones I really like. And I think I have this guy. I know I have it in blue. But I'm not sure if I have the black one. I'm going to have to look. I might have it. I might not. And oh, that's one of my favorite ones I found. I'll save that one for last. 
I found a muscle tone, which I have. It's a blind bag version or like the mystery car version. So I have a lot of these. I find these a lot and I love it. I love muscle tones. I buy every single one I find. I love muscle tones. Custom. Um, I have one of these. And the funny thing is when I was a little kid, I found it on my apartment porch when I was a little kid. And I still have it to this day. Um, and I think this one is in better shape. So I'm probably going to salvage the wheels off my old one because those are kind of cool. I don't know what I'm going to put them on. Maybe a Camaro? Ooh, that's an idea. So put that one over there because I, I believe it's in better shape than my other one. I found this and I thought it was like a different version of it because there are two different versions of this or maybe I just have an error one. But uh, I have one that doesn't have that Hot Wheels uh, thing right up there like that. I do. I have one. I'll see if I remember to add the picture of it. I don't even know if you can tell. I might have to actually dig out the truck and show it to you. But yeah, um, I thought it was the one without it. I, I assume the one without it, if that is a variation, is more common than the one with it. But I don't know now because I have two of them with it and one without. So I don't know. Maybe the one I have is an error. I kept it. Don't worry. I, I, didn't, I didn't mess with that one because I saw that and I was like, oh, wow, that might be a variation. So... Yeah, I did keep it. I got this Ferrari. I only had one of these in my collection uh, in red, so now I have a yellow one. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's a car I want to save for last as well. Got this little thing for my wife. She likes these weirder cars, so I got that for her. I wonder if there's a blue version of that thing. I might have it, but I don't know. I got this uh, Dodge Copperhead. It's a Maisto. I already have this. I don't know. This might be in better shape than mine, but I got it because I want those wheels. I'm going to turn this into a pickup truck. So let's get that out of here. <laughs> it bounced. That was funny. Um, I think I have this. I definitely used to when I was a little kid if I still don't. But if I don't, hey, I like those wheels. Those will look good on a Japanese car. This buggy, I love these buggies too. I love these. I got to fix this one, but yeah, this is pretty cool. It's a newer one, I could tell, because this is all plastic, and the older ones, I believe, were metal, and they had pipes coming out the back of them. This may have supposed to, but it broke. No, I don't actually see anything like that, so I guess it didn't. Another fast 111, but it's a different car. Pretty cool looking little thing. This is pretty cool. Now, guys, uh, don't hold me to this, but um, I'm starting to think of making certain cars from uh, video games. Like, I want to make cars from Burnout because it's my favorite game franchise. Um, my two favorite game franchises are actually Burnout and uh, Cruisin'. If you haven't checked out Cruisin' or Burnout, oh, man, they're fun. You got to play those. They're fun. They're fun or a need for speed, in my opinion. That was a horse play. I didn't have that one. I know where I can get a brand new one, a five-pack right now, but I, I saw that one. I was like, oh, I'll get it for now in case the five-pack's gone when I make my way over to that store. I think I might have already showed this. This is a Ford Excursion. This is one of my favorite ones. I don't know anything about this. I don't know what brand it is. The tires on it are really cool. I'm not going to mess with it. I know it's very damaged, but I'm going to leave it just as it is because I don't have this, so I don't want to touch it. I'm going to link the original. Um, and then my two favorite cars. I found one of my Holy Grail older Hot Wheels I wanted. I don't know if it's expensive or not, but I've been wanting it for a while. Not this. This is, I think, a Raven GT. Right? Is that what this is? Oh, it's a vulture. Oh, I knew it was some kind of bird. It's a vulture. I love this vulture. I didn't know they made the vulture in this color. This is such a cool vulture. I love this thing. I don't know where it came from, but I love that one. And then this is one of my holy grails I have wanted in my collection for the longest time. I assume it's probably an expensive one because it's an older one. Usually ones with these type wheels are kind of pricey. Um, but I found this yesterday and I was so happy when I found this. I love this pink Corvette with a big motor coming out of it. I love this. This is so cool. 
it's not in bad shape either. It's not in perfect shape, but it's not in awful shape either. Like it's got a chip right there, but it's it's very cool looking. I only have one other one of these in my collection. And it's like a baby blue one, and it has I think the bullet wheels. I think, or does it have three spokes? I think it has the bullet wheels, like the Lamborghini uh, Countach Diablo type wheels is what it has. But yeah, that is all of the um, loose cars I got. And I don't think I'm going to get any more loose cars till about the middle of next month. So, yeah. I spent a little too much on uh, some things. So... And my bikes needed repaired and stuff. So, yeah, I don't think I'm going to be getting a lot of uh, used cars. I have money for ones if I find, like, new ones in the store. That's, like, my important thing that I keep because you don't want to see them in the store and not be able to buy them because scalpers will get them. If it's cars they like. And then I got these yesterday uh, to customize. I got these at uh, Dollar Tree. A Supra a Pontiac GTO, and I got one of these. I wanted to do something with one of these a while ago, and I thought I had one, and I didn't. And I was upset about it. I was like, oh, man, I wanted to do something with one of those. So I'm going to try to buy some more of those so I have some of those to customize. But before we go, if you don't want to see this, you can leave now. I made a Camaro pickup truck, and I will show it to you in this video because I just finished it today, so... It's not perfect. It's my first one doing something like this, too, so keep that in mind. Um, but, yeah, this is a Camaro pickup truck. It was made from a regular one, and I chopped the roof off. I originally was trying to make it from a um, convertible, and I had my buddy cut it, and he messed up the roof, so I didn't want to restart and make the roof all over again, so I just kind of cheated and cut one that was already a car and just put that back part on there and added that and if you're wondering what that is right there um i'll tell you that is the plastic like when you buy a new hot wheel this right here that's what that's made from right there that's made from this not this exactly but like some of the matchboxes when you buy them sometimes they'll have plastic behind them like extra in the package that's what it's made from right there that's what it is and that's also what the that's made from. I didn't figure out how to make wheel covers, but I figured it wouldn't matter that much if I didn't do it this time. Eventually, if I figure out how to make it, I will make another one of these. This is just my first one, so it didn't turn out bad for being my first one. I actually kind of like it. But yeah, um, a Camaro pickup truck. And that's what I meant by I just said I can uh, make uh, that limo into a uh, pickup truck. Is I'm going to do the same thing to this limo that I did to this car. I'm going to cut it right here and then down here, and then I'm going to cut the trunk out and leave the fins, and I'm going to turn this into a big, big, big pickup truck. I'm probably going to make it white or gold. I might make it gold considering it's already gold on the bottom. I don't know, but I'm going to make this into a pickup truck. So, yeah, um, and probably the next one I'll show you guys in the next video whenever I do another one is um, unless you guys just want me to do a video on my custom cars all by themselves, um, I'm making a, a convertible lifted Ford F-150 Super Duty or Mega Duty, I think. It's that one that had the Goodyear on it that they came out with. I bought a lot of those on a customized because I like those trucks. And um, the other day I cut one roof off. And uh, right now... It's settling in my area because I glued some stuff back on it um, because um, it, it's custom. So the windshield's not going to really stay anymore like it was. So I had to like glue the windshield to the frame on the top. I hope it doesn't bleed onto the window or I'm going to have to paint the window. And it also glows in the dark blue. I use gl blue glow in the dark paint on it. So it's going to be pretty cool when it's done. But yeah, this is, this is very cool. I like this. It's a custom Chevy Camaro pickup truck. I like to call it the, the, um, the, uh, what would I call this thing? The pick marrow. I think it was the pick marrow is what I called it. It was either the pick marrow or the, the marrow truck. 
the the mer truck something like that i don't know but yeah i really like this thing it turned out really cool so thanks guys for watching and uh let me know if you want to see any other um of my custom cars and also um i'm thinking of doing something on the channel uh once a month or maybe twice a week a month not twice a week twice a month um of putting a car in my community tab and um, you guys can comment what you want me to do to that car. And then I'll take those comments and I'll make it into a poll. I have to ask my wife how she does that for her YouTube channel. Um, but uh, she uh, makes it into a, a poll and then people vote on it. And I'll have to ask her how she does that. Uh, and then you guys can vote on what you want me to do to the to the car like i can do anything like if you want me to make a camaro have six wheels eight wheels you want me to make a monster truck I, I can do anything i can i will give anything a try it doesn't have to be perfect as long as it looks close to what you guys asked because remember i'm i'm not a professional i mean i i'm getting at the level where i'm starting to kind of call myself a like a skilled customizer, but I'm nowhere near what some people can do with like cutting doors and making them so they can open and hoods and all that. That That's what I consider a professional, but I consider myself, you know, good, like pretty good. Like I feel like I can maybe sell some of my cars, but I'm not going to do that. But yeah. Um, anyways, thanks guys for watching. And, uh, there'll be more stuff. There will. <laughs> Bye, guys.